Worksman was founded in 1898 by Morris Worksman, a Russian immigrant. He realized there was an opportunity to replace some of the horse-drawn carriages and hand-pushed uh, wagons by attaching a trailer to a bicycle. We have continuously produced in New York City ever since the founding, and today we are very proud to be the last large-scale manufacturer of cycles in the United States. It hasn't changed much over the years. Uh, tubing is received. It is bent to the proper shape. The lugs are made by a specialty forgery overseas. Then they are brazed together, which is a low temperature welding where a brass is melted into the joint. Uh, at the same time, the wheels, the rims are being laced with spokes. Uh, the spokes are then tightened and they are trued, which means the wheels don't wobble. The frame then goes to painting. Then all these components, the frame, the wheels, all meet up in assembly where it is made to spec, whether it is a one-speed, two-speed, three-speed, seven-speed, or a tricycle. We make a uh, single rider, we made side-by-side -side tricycles, and of course industrial tricycles that get fitted with the right cabinet, and then they get shipped out all over the world. We still make bikes in a traditional way, and it says made in America, made in the USA on the head badge, but for us, it's made by Lenny. It's made by Abdul, it's made by Ray, it's made by Bob. We know these people. And this is like a source of pride. It's, it, it becomes very personal when you know everybody that's making your product. And I think that's what we're most proud of, that we, we have stuck it out. Our business is growing. We can make the argument that you can manufacture profitably and export from America. And uh, we're living proof of that.